Russian. How did you first get involved in the film? I um, was doing a play with Ray over at Trafalgar Studios and um, we just chatted backstage about lots of things and I think we made each other laugh and um, he introduced me to his friend Simon who's a writer and then we just sort of collaborated this idea all together. It seemed like you had a really good bromance on set, how long did that take or was that before the film? Uh, the bromance is um, all on my part really, I've just got this unrequited love for Ray and it's never ever given back, he just like, he just never, he never tells me he loves me or anything, it's just me looking at him hoping that he's going to say he does and give me some sort of validation. The film has been touring for years. Uh, how does it feel that it's obviously going worldwide now? Yeah, it feels good. Yeah, I mean, this sort of stuff is a, it came as a, a surprise, really. We never really knew that that was going to happen. But yeah, it, ha it just goes to show that you just never know. You do a project and it can lie dormant for ages and suddenly, you know, it kicks off the way that it does, you know. When you do anything, any film, you just don't realise, you don't know what will happen with it. You hope that it's going to get it out there to as many people as possible. You just never know. You just try and work as hard as you can in what you've been given and hopefully people, other people will like it and enjoy it. What's next for yourself? I am doing a play around the corner um, called, uh, called Christmas Carol. It's a No Coward theatre. And then um, I am doing a BBC drama. So I'm just rehearsing that at the moment. Yeah. That's that first bit about unrequited love. For, that was a joke, by the way. I don't know if anybody picked up on that, but that was... <laughs> No, that's great. Thank you for your time. I think it's the other way around. Yeah. <laughs> okay.